welcome back to Modded Minecraft. Today is gonna be exciting because we're making a ton of money here. Oh yes, there's a lot of gold in there. Oh, I just yeeted that one, that was great. But you know what's even more exciting than that? That is going down deep into my mine where I've set up two nuclear bombs to explode and help me dig farther. One, two, three, bomb! Okay, that was good. Did the other one go off too? I don't know, I'm a little bit dizzy and uh, radiated. Oh, it didn't go off, mines will go boom! Nice, that's how we mine things around here. Thankfully, we're just like North Korea where we do all of our nuclear bomb explosions underground. So let's get another one of these and we're gonna clear out a bigger area underground as soon as this giant blazing inferno goes away. Three more nukes and this should be a nice cleared out area. One bomb goes boom, two bomb goes boom, three bomb, where's the third bomb? I see you and come on, there you are, right there, boom. Now I'm hoping this area down here should be large enough to, you know what? That's not large enough. So if I jump my way out of this mine, I should be able to get lots of tomato soup and hopefully bring this back. I don't know, how much does this weigh? It weighs a solid 6,400. That should be enough to build some things. I also don't remember if it was gold or silver that I needed. Uh, let's just take both. Please game, don't crash with all my expensive stuff. Okay, that should work. Also, I haven't moved that scepter. The scepter we're gonna use to fill up dirt in the bottom of the world. I'm just hoping we have enough core stones so we can make a, a one of the grinders and then a couple drills. That's my objective anyway. We're gonna park this dump truck up right in here. Good. And then grab the bars to throw them mysteriously into this thing. Oh, that's such a bad idea. We'll just float down to the bottom and break our ankles and then jump over here, break our ankles again and run across this way into the golden statued area with the gigantic, whatever that thing is. Uh, also, where are my bars at? Where did my bars go? Are they down in this area? <laughs> break my ankles again, please, be bars Where are my bars? They're expensive, I need them. <laughs> oh, there they are. Okay, so I probably could have just carried them by hand because this is almost longer. But the good news is the tier three, whatever this thing is, is 800 core stone and 500 gold. It's also convenient that I carried up the iron first and not neither of the two things that I actually needed. Now, what was this thing? 4,000? So we have 800, we can make five things. I'm so excited. What's in there? I don't know what's in there. Let's uh, quickly purge that out of the system. I don't even know what that is. Hmm, delicious. It must have been more core stone. I'm guessing that's core stone. All right, get in there. And nope. Oh, okay, you. Sorry, I forgot that you have allerg allergies. There it is. Okay, we'll put that down. I want to make one drill. No, we're gonna make one harvester and then a couple drills. Oh, would you not? What are you doing? All right, go. Yeah, I don't. What is going on here? Okay, core stone and gold. Nope. That, why is that not working? Because it might be Claudium instead of gold. I just have to run back and get my Claudium bars now. <laughs> Okie dokie, we're back with the tier three. I believe that's Claudium plus core stone. My Claudium bar. Okay, there's the core stone. If I put that in and then I put this in and I can also put that in. Oh, dirty. Make me a thing, yes, tier three, I'm so excited. Ooh, all right, what is this? Is this a drill? That is a drill. That thing looks sick, I love it. Okay, cool. Oh, the water comes in the top side too. Interesting, wasn't expecting that. All right, so we're gonna make a tier three harvester now. Is that two, 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 three? I only need one of these. That takes 600 core stone. Oh, shoot. Thankfully, I should have enough to make one. There it is, very good. Oh, that thing looks cool too. Do you see the grinder on the top? That's awesome. All right, you guys get to go up to the top of the world. Bloop. Hopefully you disappear to the back of my truck. And I'm gonna spend the rest of my core stone making more of those drills. We're gonna make a giant mine. It's gonna be so fun. And number two, crushing. Number three and four. Number five, number six. Seven, maybe number eight? Aw, seven is a good number. Okay, now the first thing we need to do is take the grinder and hook it into here. Maybe we should unplug the whole system. Also, I'm guessing I still have a mod installed or something because, well, nothing's broken, which is fine with me because that's the mechanic in this game that I hate more than anything else. Things breaking, the durability system is annoying. Give me that, I need that. And then if I go bonk, there we go. Now I can bring that out. Cool. 
Now, please tell me you're the same system. You are, you're not, you are, you're not. We need to bring water from the left now. Why is, why is this, why game? Why, where did the water come in before it? Oh, from right there. Okay. Why is it backwards? Why do we, why are we doing that? A few moments later. And now hopefully if I plug this system back in, that should start grinding. It does. It's grinding. Very nice. Gah, 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 gah. I'm going to jump in it. Oh, it bounces me. <laughs> That's exciting. I wonder if that, ooh, look, more tomato soup. Bloop. I wonder if that gives more money. I don't really know. But I do know that it's going to take me a long time to get all seven of these things down and placed. So I might as well do a little bit of a cut. Three hours later. So good news, everyone. I've got all six of them installed. Evidently, that's all I made. And the seventh would have been the harvester. Unfortunately, we run out of water pressure right there. Even though water keeps dripping out. Ah, uh, that means I'm going to have to put a pressure tank in. And I don't know where to do that at. I was thinking, I, I honestly, I don't know. I could maybe get one in here. If I break that down and go across, we're gonna have to try that. I'll just uh, grab me legs and you know, I only need one piece, so I'm gonna run back and then use my brain to try to remember which store has my money in it and which store has the single pressure gauge. Okay, good. I think I bought the, yeah, I bought the nuke, so it's up there. I don't know how much is left, but okay, 10,000, that's enough. And by 10,000, I really meant 108,000. So I'll Goomba stomp this guy. Oh, I wanted to jump on your head. And then teleport back home. Cool. Just, just save me a little bit of time. All right. So my brain thinker in is thinker in that if I put this here, remove that. Grab another T that's hiding on the surface. Remove this piece to put here. Slap it inside like such as. Come on. Just there. Turn and then pop. Get right inside there. Okay. Then we can open that up. Grab the blue shiny rocks. Insert the blue shiny rock into the hole. That wasn't right. As I was saying, insert the blue shiny rock into the hole, into the, and then right into the, can you put the blue shiny rock, put the blue in the hole? Nope. I want, I would like to put the blue shiny rock into the hole and then close the door. Did that do it? Did that work? Do we have movement down here? We do. Oh, it's beautiful. It is beautiful. That's exactly what I need. Now I need to turn these back on but they're not gonna work because there's no soil under them. So that means I have to go back up here and grab that magical wand out of the back of the truck. And this better work on the first attempt because I don't have a tier three X. So, whoop. really? Why is that not working? Um, I can't put it on that ground. Really? I nuked it so good. I, I literally can't use it right now. Shoot, I gotta get a shovel. I also need to yeet this man into space. I figure if I buy a shovel, I'd probably get a tier three shovel. So give me these coins. 19,000 should be a sufficient amount. I could also get these pipes. Oh, they're expensive though. All right, let's get a shovel, a pickaxe. Oh boy, where am I? And I mean, the advanced rake, why not? 3,000 of my 19,000, that's fine with me. And now I cross my fingers, hoping this works. I'll slide back into the DMs, back it up, and we'll take the shovel downstairs, grab some dirt, and please work. Okay, that works. The magical wand of magic doesn't. All right, we need to flip the button on. Then we need to get dirt, get dirt, get, why, where's the shovel at? Do I have the shovel? There it is. Oh, it's working. <laughs> we have tier three. We have tier three online. I'll do that to all of them. And I believe that's all six of them working in unison. Oh yeah, we're getting lots of little nuggets coming out. That's perfect. I want to race one of these up just to see if it makes it all the way. I'm kind of concerned about this corner coming up that it doesn't drop properly because I don't didn't have room uh oh, as I was saying, I didn't have room for a funnel. I'm hoping it works. Come on. Okay, it drops off. Oh, it's working. Yes, yes. Uh oh, we do have a little discombobulation going on right here. Let's try to pick him up, drop him off. Okay, that's fine. Nothing's getting stuck. All of these resources, these are tier two and three drop into the funnel and then they head up and I'm going to be starting to make a ton of profit very, very quickly. Okay, things are dropping in very nicely. I want to see big chunks come out of here. That's actually a lot of treasure happening out. Okay, and then I'm starting to see a little bit larger chunks coming as well. Oh, look at that big core stone nugget falling in now. 
So what I think I'm gonna do is let this run for a little bit until I can make some more stuff with these bars. Like that should allow me to get one more with the stuff that's left over there, but I'll just let it roll for maybe a couple hours. So I'll go do something else. All right, so a considerable amount of time has passed. I've done a lot of increase down here, but I want to show you like as soon as this stuff starts rolling. I cleared all the dirt chunks and it gets absolutely insane once all of that system down there starts going. Look at all those dirt chunks coming up. <laughs> it's there's so much money here. I put in like an absolute buttload of these. It's it's going a lot faster now that I have these grabbing as much core stone as they can. Uh, I don't even know how many there are right now, but I'm making a ton of money on it, and that's what I'm all about. Woohoo! Look at it all go! The only problem is there's starting to be too many dropping from this funnel, and sometimes they hit each other and fall over the floor, which is why I have to clear it occasionally. I'm cool with that, though, because the results speak for themselves. I'm also not sure how much money I have up here, but I have to keep, like, dropping all of these in because they keep splattering everywhere. And the game is only partially starting to lag, so I'm right at that sweet spot of my computer crying and just having a good time. Yeah, there occasionally is a little bit of a hiccup, but look at all this money coming in. We have the core stone going nicely. We have all these other gems and rocks coming in. Oh yeah, just a little bit of frame rate drop. I'm okay with that. I, oh my goodness, look at all this gold piling. It's time, I think, my friends, to make something out of gold. Like, what would be the most expensive thing? I mean, the swords are expensive. The rings, is that a bigger ring or is that the necklace? What do we want? Should we make a gold? No, we're gonna make a, a gold necklace because I think that's the most, should I make a gold sword? Let's make a gold sword. Why not? Gold, gold, and gold. Can I make gold? I can make triple gold. Why not? All right, here we go. I have no, whoa, whoa, you see it all splatter? Okay, let's see how big this is. Oh my goodness. That's already worth $2 million. <laughs> yes. Okay, I have to uh, cut it. We have to cut it twice. Why do I have two saws? So I'm asking out here the real questions. All right, so if those get heated up, it's split in half and then split in half. Oh my goodness, it's leggy. Okay, we have the blacksmith hammer. One block, two block. I'm gonna make a golden sword. Oh yeah, there it is. Boop. Oh, oh. it's got a little gem. It should have a little gem. Okay. <laughs> 2.7 million dollars. Okay, we have to go find a store to sell this to. That is a cool looking dagger though. Okay, look at all that money going up too. Uh-oh. See, these these are the things that happen. Like, certain weird stuff just starts happening when there's too much. I can attempt to clear it all, but there might just be too much of it here to even clear. I need the magnet. This is gonna be bad. This is gonna be real bad. Yeah, we're right on that sweet leggy spot now. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ready, get set, and oh, press the button. Ready, oh, oh, <laughs> oh, that was cool looking. I wanted to wish I could do that again. Uh oh, I didn't realize how many gems there were. <laughs> it's like a gem slug. Oh, that's so cool. And then it's gonna pile in. Unfortunately, there's not that much onyx. I guess that's why the king wanted it for his big, uh, big, like ringy thing. Wow, there is hardly any onyx. So where is an armory that sells swords or buys swords? I know it's the one on the top, isn't it? On the top in the ice world. I think it's this door. Whoop. Hey, whip around the corner. Please be this door. Please be this door. Hello. Oh, 97%. Uh, I wish I could sleep a few times. I don't want to do that though. All right, I'm just going to see how much it's worth. <laughs> 2.6. <laughs> That's a lot of money. Sling, sling, sling. I mean, I don't care. It's worth 2.6 million. I'm never going to be able to buy it. I did it. Aw, I was hoping that amount of money would be even larger stack. But no, it's like here is the same as $1,000. Huh. Anyway, my friends, we have tier three mines going strong. A very, very nice uh, economy going on. I'm going to run out of water here in my truck really soon. Speaking of trucks, I think there's some other ones that we need to check out in the next video. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time. I'd like to thank all of my patrons and channel members, including Auto Dave, Ben, Dickie J, Teddy Epius, Ninja, General Harris, Trent M, Kodino, Sarnoff, Maxer, Ralph, VC Engineer, Whip It Good, Sarcasma Rex, Spencer T, Whiskey, Endless, Splatter Sax, Doug Rules, Skunk Chess, Corian, Brad, Dalton C, Sikander D, Grayson, Avora, Monkey, Kyle V, Zane W, Mr. Cripple One, Kodino, Ah, and Fussy Badge 9.